It's just fantastic. It's just lots of fun. Affordable. I mean, there's no place better. I would challenge you to find a better golf course, a better golf experience. I used to have events here at the club and it was always uh, a memorable occasion for everybody. The front nine is so different than the back nine, it's like playing two different golf courses in one. Everybody calls you by your last name, it just feels great. Almost a refuge for me from real life and the city. Our kids are older than that so they just enjoy the dining. You don't need a tea time. You just show up and there's only 260 members. They've come up with obviously some, some great programs that have made it affordable and, uh, and, and easy for guys like myself, mid-30s, to, uh, to join. The greatest asset to Beacon Hall is its members. The experience I've had with respect to food and beverage and the staff has just been exceptional. The food quality is great, the service has been, been wonderful, you never have difficulty getting a, a reservation. And then when you get into the dining room and they seat you by the windows and you have a view over the property, you feel like you've entered another world. And, and ultimately the access. We got something great here. Well, if you want to have a game, there are several ways to get a game at Beacon Hall. First and foremost, for the men, the ball toss is probably part of our, our culture. We should almost sanction the ball toss. It's a group of maybe 70 people. The balls get tossed in the air and you end up in a group. Five days a week, the opportunity to, to, to tee it up. And by the end of the round, we're, we're booking the next game together. That's a surprise to me, actually, because I really didn't know anybody when I joined. And uh, now I do through the ball toss system. And it's become the favorite part of it, actually, for me. Uh, I'm not a guy that likes making plans in advance. And I'm a last minute. I'm done work. I'm going to go play golf. And so knowing that there's a bunch of guys that are fun to play with and are always available and you can have a game going is just awesome. And the ball toss group has been so welcoming and it's so easy to get integrated uh, that it's exceptional. There's probably 30 guys that I knew by name within the first season. And now I'm in my full, second full season and it's now 45 guys. So uh, there's no uh, limitation in terms of quality of play. You show up at the times prescribed and you're welcome and uh, you, you get on the golf course. It's something that we take for granted sometimes and we really don't learn how important it is until we learn from members that have come and gone to other clubs and they have to fight that lottery system for tee times. I think that's when we learn how important access to the tee is. If a meeting cancels and you want to go play golf, you can just get in your car and come up and play. Being a downtown corporate guy, uh, just really important to get out here whenever I want with whomever I want. There's always traffic on the, on the highways here in Toronto now and if you miss your tea time at most clubs, you miss your tea time. The access to the first tea wasn't something that I thought would be super important, but it's probably at the top of my list now because there are so many days that I decide I just want to come out and play that I, that I didn't think I was going to play, and I know I can get out. And I know people struggle with that sometimes. Uh, if it's a really nice day or a busy day of the week, uh, you have to have it booked in advance and you don't have to do that at Beacon Hall. A lot of the times you can just jump off, jump off the first tee. There isn't much of, a, much of a weight or anything. You just kind of show up and you play. I can bring guests whenever I want. That's a huge benefit to a member. I think the golf course speaks for itself when you look at some of the events that we've had here, from the Copa de Las Americas, one of the leading amateur events in the world, to the Ontario Amateur, to the to the Canadian Open Pro-Am. I think organizations like that don't go to weak golf courses. We have a very special, special golf course. I have a lot of friends who play a lot better golf than I do, and they always remember the golf course. Uh, they always comment on uh, the quality of the golf, the subtlety, its uh, layout, and the grooming, and the greens, uh, and so on. You know, the difference between the front nine and the back nine, and uh, you know, the undulation and the elevation changes throughout the course. I bring people here and they say, this is a good hole. And then the next hole they say, this is a great hole. And at the end of the 18 holes they say, you know, I think I played 18 great holes. And I think that's a unique thing. Yeah, the reaction I get is, this is a jewel. Why don't we all know about this? Like, why yes. haven't I been here before? So. Well, for me, it's a fantastic setting. I just feel like it's so serene and so quiet and 
and I feel like I'm out in the country, um, and then you have a wonderful golf course at the same time. Nothing beats the access to the tee. I mean, I can get on here and play at any time. This golf course is really one of the best courses you could play anywhere in the world, and I've played extensively overseas. I've played a lot in the U.S., and the golf course is fantastic. But as important as the golf course is the ability to integrate in terms of the membership. And because of the ball toss group uh, and the welcoming uh, atmosphere here, uh, you put the combination of a great golf course and a great membership together, you can't ask for anything better. I've had business clients here that have golfed all over the world. Some of them own their own golf courses and have commented on uh, the beauty of the place and the, uh, the staff and the treatment they got while they were here, second to none. I think, uh, in my mind, it's really trying to cater to the membership, uh, knowing the members, uh, and I think they do, uh, people in, in FNB, they know each member, uh, and they're willing to cater to you. I know, for example, whenever steak is being served, I don't have to ask for it to be well done. I always get a well done steak. They help you out whatever you need, whether it's spikes or uh, sunscreen. What surprised me about Beacon Hall, and, and has been the difference maker for me, is what a great club it is, uh, the great people. We've had the good fortune to live on the property for seven years. We've met the majority of our friends here. And the fact that my family loves coming here, the kids use the pool, they love coming to the range. Um, there's just no end of, uh, of value for the family. One of the special features of 2013 was the advent of a sponsored intermediate program. I call it Seeding the Future where we introduce 12 young people between the ages of 30 and 39 to Beacon Hall in a wonderful special program. That sold out in about one week. Well, the younger members that have come in are passionate because they're playing, which is great. And they come to the ball toss, they get to meet people. I've met a whole bunch of them. And they're good, and it's been fun. Uh, you don't have to be the best golfer in the world. You know, it, it's a golfer's enthusiast course. Obviously, a very fabulous golf course. It, uh, I think it'll test the best of them. And um, for a guy like myself, who is not a good, really good player, it's also uh, a course I can play on as well. So it suits all level of players. And it's the best there is, I think, in Canada. Everybody is committed to getting better and to practicing. So there's a real um, atmosphere of, of excellence about the golf component, but at the same time, everyone really wants to have fun too. And you want to have a place that uh, uh, really uh, makes you a better golfer, this is it. We are definitely a golf club first and foremost, but we are not just a golf club. We have a fantastic clubhouse. We do wonderful social events in the clubhouse. We have great lounge space. We have great dining space. When you move to the golf operation, I think our professional staff, including our, our teaching staff, uh, you combine that with, with an enthusiastic backshop operation, I believe our golf course is as good as any, second to none. You just can't get better value and a better experience anywhere else. People have said to me, if you're going to join a club, join somewhere where you know lots of members or else you're going to be playing on your own all the time. Completely not the case at Beacon Hall. We've made some long-lasting friendships. I'm looking forward to hopefully another 20 or 25 more years. You know, committed to be a full member and, um, and that was it. It's like home, if you love golf. Well, I, you know, again, they, they uh, just do it. <laughs> How about that? In a place you're going to be very proud of to be a member.